Roughly align the laser to the center of the spindle. Now measure the distance from the spindle center to the TRS-2 receiver. The range is now adjusted to this distance using the receiver focus screw on the side of the unit. Rotate the spindle at 200, 1000 or 5000 revs per minute. Then make a visual check of the bar graph lights. The aim is to light up as many of the bar graph lights as possible. Further range adjustment may be necessary to optimize the bar graph illumination. A paper target is required to aid the laser focusing process. Paper targets are available in the back of the user guide. The target should be mounted on a static tool with either tape or blue tack. Using a pin spanner, loosen the locking ring of the laser focus screw by a quarter of a turn. With a flat bladed screwdriver, adjust the laser focus screw until the size of the laser spot on the target is minimized. Use the pin spanner to tighten the locking ring securely, taking care not to move the laser focus screw. Finally, remove the paper target from the tool. The smallest tool should be driven approximately 3 mm into the laser beam. The TRS-2 must be finely aligned and secured so that the laser beam is aimed at the center of the tool and perpendicular to the tool axis for optimum performance. A spirit level can be used to aid this alignment process. If it's not perpendicular, performance will be affected.